Thank you guys for writing a great song. And I, I mentioned this earlier to John. I, I've been really um, lucky, blessed to, to be uh, able to cut some songs that have been really written from the heart. Uh, I felt that way when I heard, um, you're thinking me, I felt that way when I heard Making Memories of Us. And when I heard this song, it felt like it was cut from that cloth. Uh, for, for me, the way I felt about it, I knew it, I knew it had come from a real place, you know, because you can, it's a very smart town, everybody can rhyme words and be really clever with lyricism, but there, for me, there's certain songs that you, they resonate in a different way because they're, they're coming from a place of truth. Uh, this song for me had that place of truth in it, or it was swimming in it, this is what I loved about it so much. Um, I wanted to do the song justice because I feel like I've been on both sides of this song, uh, I've definitely had uh, people be that rock for me, and I've been um, fortunate enough to be able to be that rock for others as well, so I, I can relate to the song so strongly. Um, so I feel really honored that I got sent the song, got to record it. Uh, I took it to Nathan and said, I've got this song I'd, I'd love to do. I love working with Nathan because he, <clears throat> he either loves a song or he doesn't. And what I mean by that is there's some producers who'll be like, yeah, let's cut them all. And he'll be like, I like this one, not that one, not that one, not that one. You know, and he, he will pass up a song that I think will be really successful, but if he's not feeling it, he'll be like, I can't do that. So he only does stuff that you feel. It says a really beautiful thing. God bless you for that. What a, what a, what a great way to be. Um, I love that because I know that when I get in the studio, we're doing it for the right reason together. Uh, he believes in the song as much as I do. So we went into Sound Emporium uh, with Joe Baldridge, who engineered the track. I want to give a shout out to Joe, who did a masterful job engineering. Uh, we put together a band made up of um, Matt Chamberlain on drums, and I said to Matt, who do you want to play, anybody you want to play bass with? And he said, there's this girl called Tal Wilkenfeld, who he says, I've never played with her, I'd love to play with Tal. So we brought Tal to town, and this is the first song she played on. And it was Tal's idea to do the opening bass line that you hear on the song. So I, the reason I give shout outs like that is because the musicians are incredibly creative on all of these songs and they never get the props and they certainly don't get the royalty. So I'd like to give a shout out for Tal on that cool little bass riff. Together. Country Radio, thank you so much for playing this song, believing in it, getting behind it. Uh, all the country networks that uh, played, the, uh, played the lyric video because we didn't get to shoot a video. Um, but uh, Everybody in my band and crew that gets it every night and plays the song. It's just a great feeling to get a song that connects with people. And the very first time we played this song, I think I did an acoustic somewhere, and I could just feel people in the audience got it the way I got it. So um, it's, a, it's a great feeling to have that. And uh, I thank my wife for um, uh, being the person who I've been able to be this rock for, and who has very much been my rock as well. So. Thank you very much, everybody, for coming out to this party. Thank you, Third Man. Fill the place.